Hi, Randy Martinez here from IT Pros Management. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to sync your SharePoint document library down to your Windows File Explorer. I've gotten a lot of requests from our clients, and I'm going to go ahead and show you how to take care of that today. Okay, here we go. Hi, so let's go through the process of uh, syncing your SharePoint document library down to your Windows File Explorer. Now here's a landing site that we've created, which is a demo site that we use for training purposes and demonstrations. In this particular site, we set up our document library over in this area where it says Team Files. So we're going to go ahead and click here to enter into our document library. So here's our SharePoint document library. This is where we have all our folders and files that we use in our day-to-day -day business. We want to go ahead and sync these down to our Windows File Explorer so we can access them from Windows File Explorer. So to do that, we're just going to go up to the top, click on the little sync button here. And as you can see, this window pops up here. Now I want to be very clear on a couple things. One is SharePoint and OneDrive are two different things, two different platforms, but they use the same technology to sync. They use the OneDrive technology to sync. That's why you see here it says OneDrive. So don't get it confused. We are not syncing OneDrive. We are syncing the SharePoint document library, but it is using the OneDrive technology. Click on Open. And as you can see here, we get a message saying that our IT Pros Demo Landing Documents library is now being synced to our uh, File Explorer. So let's go ahead and check that out. So now let's go ahead and open up our Windows File Explorer and see what's happened. As you can see here, the IT Pros Demo Landing Documents library has been synced down to the Windows File Explorer on my laptop. And it's been actually synced down into the SharePoint section of my laptop, not the OneDrive. So here's the difference. OneDrive is this little blue cloud. SharePoint is this blue, blue little building. So we are now in the document library synced that you can see here in the SharePoint site. And as you notice, folders that are listed here are also listed here. I want to draw your attention to one thing, the status button. You see little clouds here. What this means basically is that my document library is synced to this cloud location. That means if I happen to lose internet connectivity, I would not be able to access these folders on my file explorer because I would not have access to the internet to get to here. Um, you can sync these down if you right click on a folder and if you want a particular folder to be on your device all the time, when you click on right click on that particular folder, you can always say keep on this device. When you click on that, that you can see turns into a little green check mark. What that does, it copies the contents of that particular folder and then now that folder will always be accessible whether I have internet connectivity or not, I can access it. This is kind of helpful if you're traveling and you're going to be in locations maybe where there's no internet and you still need access to your files, doing this is an excellent way to access your data. Rest assured that when you do connect back, any changes you've made to the folder will be synced up back into your SharePoint location. So you'll always have a clean copy. But as you can see, this is a very good way of keeping access to your documents, whether you're on the go, have internet access, or don't. So to recap, I showed you how you can sync your SharePoint document library as well as individual folders to your local computer's Windows File Explorer. I also showed you how you're able to keep a copy of your SharePoint folder on your local computer so you can access it if you find yourself offline or unable to connect to the internet. If you found this video helpful, go ahead and give us a thumbs up and click on the subscribe button below to get notified when we release additional training videos to help you navigate your modern workplace. If you have any questions or want us to leave us some positive comments, please be sure to comment below. Well, thank you for spending your time with me, and I look forward to reading your comments. Take care, and bye-bye.